Hi, this is Annette with digitalphotographyhowto.com and today I'm going to teach you how to put different page elements onto your blog. So first you'll log into blogger.com, you'll go to your dashboard and you're going to choose layout. Then from here you're going to see your page elements. They're either going to be on the left or right hand side. There's already a blog archive and an about me and if you want to change the about me you click edit or the blog archive click edit but we're going to add some more page elements so I'm going to click add a page element then from here you can there's a bunch of different things to choose from blog lists subscription links slideshows polls link lists adsense HTML code where you can put different images um, there's just a bunch of different things. For now, I think we might just do, let's just add a blog list. So you click add to blog. And then um, you can change the title if you want. Um, you can make it so that it's alphabetical or by the most recently updated blog. And you can choose right here what you want posted. When you're ready to add, you just click add a blog to your list and it will bring up a thing for you to type the URL. So you do www dot and you put the the whole blog address in there. Sorry, I can't talk and type at the same time. So we're doing a mom's, I have a blog named Mom's Brainstorm. And so we're going to add that. You can rename it if it's a blog of a friend and they named it, they named their blog something weird and you want to know them by their name, you can rename it or you can remove it right here and you can add to the list right here. Just click add to list and you can put more blogs right there. For now, we'll just keep that one um, and we'll click save. And then it automatically added it right over here, my blog list. So you can add as many elements over to the side as you want. Um, I like to do a subscription link, which um, so people can subscribe to your blog, so they'll always be um, up. They'll know when you updated your blog. You can also put a page element down on the bottom, underneath your blog, um, and I'll probably just do. Let's do a newsreel. So you just click add to blog under the newsreel. It just has current um, information on it. And then you just click save. Okay, you can add more to the bottom too if you want. Now, if you want your, if you have an image, like if you're a business or if you created something in. Photoshop, you know, some word art for your blog, you can add it right here um, up to the top. So you can just click edit and then you can do the blog title, a blog description. You can put an image, an image from your computer that will show up right up there at the top or an image from the web. Um, you can have it behind the title and description instead of the title and description. So if it was like a picture of a cute, like, preschool rug or something, I would put it behind the title and description so you could still see it. Um, you can make it shrink to fit the page. You could just do all that right there. So um, now that's all there is to adding an element. Once you're done, you'll just scroll back up to the top, click save, and then you can click view blog and it will open it in a new tab up at the top. And there it is right there. So you can see there's our subscribe to our, and our blog lists that we added the elements for right there. You can add pictures and everything else. And you can see down here that our news, our news reel is right here. You can't see it because it kind of blends into the color of my layout. But anyway, um, come back and I will teach you how to add more exciting things to your blog, how to post um, easily. Have a good day.